Today I'm making a work of art inspired by a type of Mexican folk art called amate paintings. First I'm going to carefully tear the edges of my paper to give it the look of the handmade paper that real amate paintings are made with. While one hand does the tearing, the other hand is holding down the paper close to the edge so that I don't accidentally tear the paper all the way to the middle. Even though the video is sped up now, I'm doing this slowly and carefully the whole time, and you will too. Now, real Amate paintings feature subject matter such as birds and other wildlife, flowers, plants, and scenes from everyday life. You'll get a handout with ideas inspired by these traditional images. Your artwork must have a border and at least three images inspired by Amate paintings. And you can copy the images from the handout. You can make up your own or do a little bit of both. And you'll be drawing with a pencil first, then tracing over everything with a marker. For the sake of this video, I'm just using a marker. Now it's time to paint. I'm using bright neon colors to mimic the bright colors in Amate paintings. Now remember to paint carefully and always wash your brush in the water and dry it on a cloth or sponge before getting a new color. One thing to note about this paint is that it doesn't look very bright or opaque when you first put it on the paper, but it looks a lot better when it dries. And once the paint is dry, I will go back with my black marker and outline anything I want to stand out more, especially the things I painted over, like the veins in the leaves. So remember, take your time, do your best, and you'll have a beautiful neon nature painting inspired by Amate paintings.